Good morning, day, afternoon, evening to uh, to all of you whenever and wherever you are. Now we are here continuing our uh, Surviving Mars playthrough and we are just waiting for the resources. Uh, two payloads of 25 electronics each to um, send our rocket out on one of the planetary missions to increase our research output and uh, keeping an eye on those yeah they disappeared good really wanted um, research Dr. to go up Stand. so thank you again uh, yeah really want that research to go up as quick as possible one second we don't need to pause actually let's just put them down here right next to us got the electronics now and wait with you uh, yeah, we want to send you on this high-speed comms uh, satellite over here. There we go. And let's decommission the supply pods as well for some extra metals. How many metals does it give you? Five each. So that's uh, ten extra metals. Uh, so that's going to give our moisture vaporators running for another three souls at least. So that's good. Always welcome for extra resources. And yeah, so. Oh, miscalculation on my behalf. It's not just 100 fuel, it's 160. Now, the payload, which is the 100 metals, 100 electronics, and 100 fuel, that's the stuff that goes into setting up that satellite. But our rocket still needs some fuel to fly there. Um, yeah. Well, I suppose we're just gonna have to wait a little bit then. Oh, that's okay. Um. I was about to say that there is no rush, but there actually is, since we want that research as soon as possible. Now, talking about research, our next one should be done fairly soon. 81%, which will give us an extra 100. Now, whilst we're waiting for all, all this to happen, let's see if we can bring in some more resources. We can bring some metals from here so let's do that and bring them here now these are already full so we're gonna have to put down another metals depot let's do it right over here and since oh there's another one wow they are quite frequent um yeah, so since we just had a meteor storm in the last episode, I think, there are some resources we could pick up from here as well. Wow, there is a lot of metals. 30, it's like 300 worth of metals down here. Plus some polymers as well, which I'd really like to bring in. Ooh. Okay, let's keep an eye on this stuff here. And let's hope it's not gonna come down. Down to you. So 48 metals. Ooh. Research. What is the next one? I think we are just gonna save this. Now, let me just explain real quick as well why. <laughs> why are we saving this uh, and it might not make sense at all and i'll do it right after i ensure that this guy over here is not going to get wrecked by sector one scan of these where is it going it's going up now is it time to bail maybe Maybe not. Oh, they're right around him.
Wow. Oh, that was so close. Still is. No. Mm. Yeah, that's. It's like playing with fire. Come on, off you go. I think. We're fine. So let's set up this route again. Yeah. Right, so coming back to the um, why we are saving them and. And why not just do them straight away? Because overall, um, uh, it's, it's research. It, it doesn't increase or decrease over time. And that is true. However, the things that I'm researching right now, um, everything that's on this list, um, we, we very much like them, but it's not like one of those that we want to have like... Um, ASAP. Now, this is an exception, but it's 94% done. Now, the reason why I'm keeping them is wrong window. Research over here. Once we go down the physics tab over here and we get to something, mm, something that we want to have straight away, such as the um, scrubbers. And they are, they're going to be quite, uh, quite expensive to research about, uh, I don't know, like 10,000 or, or more, uh, depending on how up or down it is in the, in the research tree. So the reason why I'm saving those, uh, anomalies is once we get to something expensive that we want and with the low research output that we have, once we get there, we can go and uh, research those an anomalies. And therefore, boost the, the research of those technologies that we want to get um, fairly quickly. So we don't have to wait, you know, 5, 10, 20 souls potentially. Um, and especially with scrubbers as well, the quicker we get them, the better. And yes, you know, I'll, I'll still have to go down the tree. And uh, it's, you know, it's still going to take the same amount of time. Um, but at the same time, if we get anomalies that help us to reveal some of the tech, that means we don't have to research something in the physics tree that we don't want to. So I hope this kind of makes sense. So in a way, I am saving a bit of research if we um, reveal some of that. Uh, was it the physics? Yeah, it was the physics tree using one of the anomalies so so that's the kind of reasoning behind it i hope it i hope it makes sense as well if it doesn't i do understand it might have been uh maybe my explanation isn't the best at times but it will make sense maybe later than if, it, if it didn't complete. already make sense right so we have the earth mars initiative nice uh, which means our research output is now 300 per soul. And, well, planetary service is almost going to be done as well, since it was queued up. Uh, well, Sterling generators, we are going to like... Hmm. Are we or are we not? I think... Even though a few episodes ago we... We did say that we want the sterlings. I'm starting to think that these resources right now are too precious. And Sector since we scanned. have, thank you, since we have so many metals, it might make more sense. Yeah. To go with this instead. Um, and that is because, I mean, there could be some planetary missions that we're about to, some new ones that we're about to get that need the, some of the higher tier resources. So it will be best to 
save them. Plus, I think we are already using... No, we're not using polymers. We are. Power accumulator is using polymers. Right, so... Um, yeah, it's gonna make more sense to use this. This metal's maintenance is 0 0.7. Nothing... 0 0.1, it's not bad. 0 0.3. Yeah, it's gonna make more sense to make... Um, uh, solar panels. Once we need power, of course. Uh, right now. I mean, at the same time, they don't really cost any maintenance. Mm. It's a bit of a chicken and an egg thing, isn't it? But I still think... Um, yeah, I think solar panels will be... Will be better for the time being. I do want to save the high tier resources. Yeah, I think we'll prioritize that. Right, rocket, fuel, just waiting for fuel. Uh, uh, did we not say that we wanted to make research this? I think we did. Yeah, I think once... Since we're so close to planetary survey over here, I think we're gonna complete this first. And then we'll um, we'll switch to the low-G hydrosynthesis over there. Yeah, let's do that. Now I sort of start wishing I did install some mods. Some quality of life mods, not to alter the gameplay. I mean, affect the gameplay too much. Things such as increasing the speed. Especially in times like this where there isn't really much that I can I can do right now. Uh, it would be nice to speed up the time a little bit more. Uh, there are still some resources here, so... There's one. Wait, so... Can't get them both. Fine. Grab these. Wait. Let's do this instead. Okay, this one will queue up these two. Pretty sure there was some more. No. Okay, so in that case, after you're done, come back here. Cool. So waiting just for fuel. We need another 34. This produces 12 per soul. So that's three... Less than three souls and we can send this rocket out. Um, sure. And as soon as we get the... Sector next scanned. Anomaly hmm. found. Okay, well... There we go. So this is... Let's see. Let's, let's go and scan it. Before I say anything, scan that and then we'll queue so you come back. No storms in the way, is it? Nothing over here, no. Thinking, yeah, let's do that. Let's ping you here. Wait. Assign. Let's put a few drones. So how many you have? You have three now. Okay, now... You can come and start building this ramp. And he's going there. Wow, okay, there's a lot of resources here. Yeah. Once he's done with this section, uh, sector over here, we'll send... I'll transport the robot down here as well and just start picking up all the goodies, goodies from here. Right, 97% done. 98, we are very close. Yep, I know it's heavy loads, but we don't have any spare drones right now, so it will have to be like that. Another 21 medals over here. 
good. Yeah, we definitely... We definitely need the factory or extractor AI, I think that was called. Anomaly analyzed. Yeah, I don't quite remember what it was called, Sector but scanned. essentially Research the complete. breakthrough that allows us to use the extractors without any any um, people manning them. Right, so let's have a look. We have done... Wait up. Next research. Right, get a one-time subsidy of one billion. I think this is going up next. Yep. 4,000 research though. It is going to take a very long time. However, um, there's more to the barren environs of the red planet than meets the eye. A veritable treasure trove of undiscovered knowledge and wonder. Right. So long as you know where to look. All right. Thank you, good sir. This one here has revealed a couple of things. So hygroscopic vaporators and topology AI. And this one, moisture vaporator upgrade, gives us uh, increase the production of of uh, the vaporators by fifty percent. That is a very good one. That I think will be one of the first ones we'll do as well. And the other one was. Drones work faster on landscaping projects. Meh, don't need it right now. Uh, planetary survey. Uh, let's wait. Six new anomalies. Wait. Planetary anomalies. Yeah, planetary. Here we go. So we have RC Explorer for research progress. That will be good. People. No. No. New technologies, I think we'll go for this one next. Yeah. Resources is okay. People. Thrones. New technologies again. Oh, that one gives a... Ah, oh, it's with people. Yeah. Right, we'll just wait for this one. To complete and we've almost scanned all this area here I think we'll do this one and this one as well and then we'll start moving up right how are you guys doing here 20% done okay you are going back and you oh good timing uh, let's check the rocket as well. We are 81 fuel, another 19 to go. Seems we have three sitting somewhere. Oh, this is getting filled up. May have to bring the drone commander back. Hopefully. I don't know if they'll manage to finish this though. Maybe. Maybe not. Well, we'll see. Alright, so these... Oh, there's another one. We will send you... I think there was resources. Yeah. Um, so you can take all this stuff. And let's bring it back to base again. Let's see. 86 now. And here, 58%. Right. I might be able to clear it, actually. So that would be very nice. That means once we start you now scanning this area here as well. Let's do this one. Here. No, let's go here. And then we can um, send the explorer up to this plateau over there. Oof. There are four twisters over here. Yeah, you see, I think I said in the previous, one of the previous episodes that 
it seems we were on soul 40 i think it seems they really like to spawn in this area over here i mean yes we do spot them on the other sides of the map as well but um this seems like the main area and then if we want to put some domes down here well that's going to be interesting yeah all right another one almost scanned hmm All right, that's gonna give us an extra billion. Ninety-three on this. Nine percent. Okay. So. Scanned. Anomaly found. Ooh, hello. Let's another breakthrough. We'll take that. Once you're done, come back. And we got some resources here as well. Thirty-nine metals. 18%, ooh, 95, yeah, we're not going to make it, well, actually, interesting, it says 18% here, although on this bar, it seems to be a lot higher. Or maybe it makes sense. It was 100. Right, maybe it's 200%. So 100% was first digging out that waste rock. And now they are just leveling. So it's kind of like a two-stage thing. Alright, so he's collecting that. You're already scanning. I think the rocket has left. Yep. So that's four souls without the rocket. Um, we will... Wait until this is done. And then we'll send the drone commander back after that. Yeah. So that's almost done. Let's see what sort of breakthrough. Break shall we get discovered. this one? Eternal fusion. So fusion reactors upgrade. Uh, reactors no longer require workers and operate at 150 performance. Now that is amazing. Um... But again, uh, it's not the one I wanted to have right now. Now I may have to start planning for the possibility that we will not get that. What was it called? Like, um, it's not factory, extractor AI, I think. If we don't get extractor AI, that means the only way we will get met uh, rare metals well, we could get some from the planetary missions, but that's going to be like 30 at most. But if you want to get a reliable supply of those metals to export it back to Earth to get some money, we will have to bring in some people. Same thing with metals. I mean, it's, it's good we're, we're collecting all this and we can always, you know, call down some more meteor storms. But to get a steady supply. Um, we are going to need people. So you're done. Bring in some polymers and metals. Let's see. Next one we'll do this here. Don't think we're going to get any anomalies from here. But hopefully. Electrostatic dust storm approaching. Alright, do we have water? We do. This means the rocket will not be able to land. That has stopped working. Oh, we we're almost done with this, so... That's okay. I have a bit of power. No. Oh. Alright, come on. 97%, almost there. Yeah, that's fine. So the rocket... Wait, how long was this for? I think it was for three days. Sector scanned. So it actually might finish before the um, rocket finishes the mission anyways. No, it won't. This is three souls. This comes in one. If it's three, that means in four souls it will be done. Well, 
more likely in five because it's one soul in 20 hours. So it's almost a full soul. Okay, so this one's done. Let's go. I'll bring you back to base. So you can control these drones again. Amplify it. Do we want it? I think we do. Or maybe we don't. Thing is, if we use two polymers, and polymers is gonna be it is the cheapest thing to bring in. Um. Yeah. I think we do want this. Are you guys still working? Should be. Yeah, he is almost back. Shower incoming. Ooh. Extra resources. Yeah, again, I'm hoping it's not gonna land directly on top of us. Hmm. Alright. So again, it seems uh, we're at this point of time that there isn't really a whole lot of things we can we can really do right now. We've got two storms coming in. Uh, let's... Um, I think we can still send you out again. Yeah, collect those. Pretty sure I asked you to collect them before. Maybe one of those is full? No, it's not. This one's still empty. Oh, the polymers might be full. So... Let's do a polymers depot then. Let's put one here. Let's do the same for other things as well. Now we don't really have them right now, but just in case. Let's put a depot here. And machine parts. And not fuel. Fuel we have. Let's check the research as well. Alright, so that was the money. Alright, the reason why we have it is second, even though we don't have any any wind turbines and uh, turbines. Uh, it's just to reveal some of the some more text over here. Working our way up to the uh, scrubbers. If possible. Now I think um, I know it's very early in, in the, this series. We are still on the Sol 52, um, and so far things have worked out relatively okay, I should say. Um, but I would like to try. Uh, well, well, again, we'll, we'll see how it goes. Um, but I, I think at some point I would like to try um, uh, trying to do a playthrough. Um, with even increased difficulty. I did a little bit of research about this and it seems 10.45% uh, I don't think it was the highest. I think 10.75 was the was the highest in one of the videos that I saw. And um, I was thinking of trying that but on top of it uh, to introduce some um, Sector scanned. Thank you lady. Introduce some other um, rules as well such as the things that are making this um playthrough a lot easier for example for example the the scrubbers once you get them all you need is power you will never need maintenance besides the tomes of course because uh, you can lay out the network um so i'm thinking of uh, you know maybe adding some different rules as well but um, let's not get ahead of ourselves let's first see if uh, we're able to manage our colony and um, get to the point where we can actually bring people on on tomorrow's and and have them live live and work here with uh, without dying and again it is fairly early in in this playthrough so don't wanna Get ahead of myself too early. We still have very serious threats available. 
from the uh, from the meteors if if they uh, landed directly on top of us, but also the dust storms and and dust devils as well that that go around. So yeah, let's see how it goes. Now rocket is seventy five percent now, which means one soul. The um, Electrum electrostatic dust storm stays for another two souls, so that's okay. I suppose we only have to wait one soul, but by the time we can land, we will have enough fuel to go for our next mission. Or maybe, yeah, we still have an option to send it home as well, but I don't think. I don't Sector really know scan. if you need to or want to. Let's quickly check what's the prices now. Have they gone up again? Uh, what was it before? No, it's still 480. Okay. The prices are still where they were before. Uh, so, moisture vapor is not working. Another sector, sector scanned. Alright, so there's nothing there. Come on, zoom out. I'm afraid it's going to be the same with these two, that there's not going to be any anomalies here. So we should focus our efforts on the ones that are likely to have anomalies. Right. Wait, meteor storm in one hour, so maybe I think it's smarter to bring you back for the time being and let's see where Right, so the meteors are coming down there. In that case, you go there. And he's on. Okay. Three buildings are not working. Where's the third one? Oh, yeah, the subsurf. No, okay, so that was hit by lightning. Anomaly found. And. Right, so that came from one of the meteors, and that's fantastic. So we have two research anomalies. So that's up to 3,000 research points. Or what's the lowest? I think so far the lowest we've had was thousands. Can it go any lower than that? I don't know. Maybe. Maybe we've just been lucky enough to have at least a minimum thousand RP um, quarantined with the ones. High speed comp satellite. It's now online. And yes, we have the extra research now. So that goes up to 700 from three, 300 we had before. And that's drastically going to speed up our research efforts. So now instead of uh, this taking, what was it before, like 11, roughly down like 11 souls, it's gonna be more like 4 or 5. Well, a couple left now, since we're, so 2,000 left, yeah, 3 more souls. And we should have the money. Is there anything else that we want to focus on? These will just require fuel, so nothing major. Maybe some more meteors as well. Resources are low. Is it? No, it is not. We have plenty in stock. We did wanna right, let's not forget this. Once this research is done, we do wanna boost the um fuel refinery up. And you can't land here. Okay. What were the other missions? So we've done that, research, analyze 30 anomalies, so we're almost there to get another rocket. So nine more, so that's good. That's not gonna happen anytime soon. And still seven more. How many can we do? One, two, three, four, five. So we have seven available to us, we need two more. Good. Alright, the dust storm is almost over. So that is nice. So we'll have to select the next mission as well. A uh, couple of options. I think I'm gonna keep the um, 
the research ones. Again, save them once we um, find the things that we really want. And we might do another meteor one actually. Because the meteors have a chance to uh, give us some more anomalies. And it seems they're, at least so far in my experience, they've only been the research ones. I don't know if they uh, have a low chance of, of giving any other anomalies or, or not. So far that I've played in the past one, two days or so. I've Sector only scanned. received the um, research ones. Another sector done, so let's queue up. Hmm, could be one there, but let's choose this one here. Right, 13, 12, 12 hours and 59% of this. We are almost there. Uh, quite a healthy amount of concrete. And that is, yeah, we passed the halfway mark. I just realized I forgot I had a transport route still running whilst well, the meteor shower, but it seems like they're staying on this plateau over here. So that's good. And he's paused now, so okay, let's bring him back. Where should we? Alright, quick save. Uh, let's grab this from here. And we'll bring you back. Four hours and then we can land. Bring a rocket back as well. Well, that was very close from our very massive base over here. That's kind of funny because our base is so small. Um, all it takes is just one lightning hit right in the middle here. I don't know if it turns off everything in the, in the sort of like area or just one building all right and here's our rocket landing so um this video is already quite long enough so with the landing of the rocket here we can um, call it an episode and, and thank you very much for joining and see you in the next one